हे गाइस दिस दिव्या एंड आई एम बैक विद अनदर एपिसोड ऑफ पर्सनालिटीज टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग पर्सनालिटी वेरी इंस्पायरिंग पर्सनालिटी सो हिज नेम इज राजा राम मोहन रॉय बिफोर आई बिगिन आई वुड लाइक टू रिक्वेस्ट टू सब्सक्राइब वाइश शेयर चैनल इफ यू हैवेंट एंड ऑल्सो ऑल्सो सब्सक्राइब वाइश कोर्सेज एंड वॉच द फाउंडेशनल वीडियोज मेड बाई वाइश सर विच आर ऑल्सो अवेलेबल इन हिंदी watch those videos before you watch any of our of our, of these videos and start your upsc preparation those videos are very crucial and as they found here uh, you know as they form your basis right so let's begin and if you face any difficulty or you need any guidance for your upsc preparation you can contact vice sir so let's begin so raja ram mohan rai he was uh, he was an indian socio religious He was a social religious reformer. He was born on twenty second May, seventeen seventy two, in Bengal Presidency, India. So, although he was born into a family of Orthodox Hindu Brahmins, Raja Ram Mohan Rai was Roy was a progressive man who has uh, who was against the social bigotry, Orthodox Hindu rituals, and superstitions. He fought against social evils like sati, child marriage, polygamy, and the caste system. he also fought for the women and demanded property inheritance rights for them he later formed a reformist uh, society called the brahmo samaj which about which we read in uh, spectrum also so brahmo samaj to fight against social injustice now we'll know about his childhood his father his father was ramakant he was a vaishnavite and his mother tarini devi was a a shaivite fam- was from a shaivite family so one parent prepared him for the occupation of a scholar the shastri while the other secured him all the worldly advantages needed to launch a career in the law cake or worldly sphere of uh, public administration so he was torn between the two parental ideals from early childhood and ram mohan roy he never uh, you know between the two uh, he he vacillated between the uh, two for the rest of his life so during early uh, early rule of east india company ram mohan roy acted as a political agitator whilst employed by the east india company in 1814 he started aatmiya sabha that is society of friends a philosophical discussion circle in kolkata to propagate the monotheistic ideals of the vedanta and to campaign against idolatry caste rigidities meaningful uh, meaningless rituals and other social ills Ram Mohan Roy was well read and he knew several uh, different languages he believed education can modernize society and set up several schools and colleges in bengal he studied he studied vedas upanishads and other religious texts ram mohan roy founded a reformist society called the brahmo samaj which aimed at fighting against social injustices he founded unitar- unitarian community to fight to fight against the social evils as well as to propagate social and educational reforms these institutions played a major role in reforming indian society he revived the pure and ethical principles of the vedanta school philosophy uh, preached the unity of god translated vedic scriptures into english and integrated western modern ideas into indian society and the education system he saw the evils in the hindu society and sought to end them by reforming various aspects of the society with the assistance of his western connection he set up several schools and colleges in bengal like the hindu college anglo hindu college vedanta college and scottish church college he also wrote journals his mo- his most popular journal was sambad komudi in which he covered topics like freedom of press separation of the executive and judiciary so what a visionary i would say now what led to the title of raja so raja mohan uh, ram mohan roy he went to england as an envoy of akbar shah ii he was the then mughal emperor of india and the emperor rewarded him with the title of raja he also met many members of the british parliament and published book on indian economics and law he died of meningitis on 27th september 1833 at the age of 61 while staying in england he rests in the arnos vale cemetery in brussels which is in england now his legacy doodle has a dedicated a um, google had dedicated a doodle in um, in in his respect so raja Ma- ram mohan roy will always be remembered as a great reformer who brought to an brought an end to the evil practices of sati and he worked towards reforming the society 
and he sought to empower women. He is considered to be the father of Bengal Renaissance by many people. So with this. So with this we have come and end to this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll meet in the next one. Thank you so much.